In this episode of the mirror tool, we're going to start with our line. Right click, set as mirror line, and we see that it's highlighted in green. And we're going to draw a rectangle. And pull key. Notice that we've left the mirror line. We haven't deleted the mirror line. So we've left the mirror line in position. And we're going to pull this up. And we get two. Now, there are certain actions we can perform on this while it's in mirror form. But there are actions that we can't perform, such as, suppose we were in the pull tool and we double click on that edge, we've got the round corner selected there, type one millimeter return, we can get around on both of them, around on that one and that one. So we can also do it on that one. Now we didn't want that round that way, yes. One again. So now we've got rounds on both edges, which is lovely. Okay, so suppose we want to put a hole in both of these. Select the circle, select that face, draw a circle on it, two, we'll see, we'll make it five. Pull. All seems good up to this point, but when I try to drag it through, whoops, everything disappears. It will not pull a hole through, control Z. However, by clicking on any face, we'll get the mirror plane back, which we can select, left click, and delete it. Once it's deleted, we can pull a hole, but we can't pull it right through the two of them. So I don't know whether that's a, a fault with the program or it's a deliberate restriction. But you can perform some activities in mirror f fashion and not others. So it's worth knowing. Bye for now. See you later.